In the tranquil Pacific, Guam, an island known for its crystal clear waters and picturesque landscapes, is becoming the center stage for a defense initiative that is more than just monumental. The skies above Guam are preparing to host a trial of might and technology. Picture this. December 2024, a Navy Aegis weapon system, a powerful instrument known for its versatility, is deployed on Guam's shores. Paired with the SM-3 block IIA interceptor, they stand ready, aiming towards the vast expanse of the sky. This is the vision set by Rear Admiral Doug Williams, the acting director of the U.S. Missile Defense Agency, as he anticipates the forthcoming flight test. The horizon for Guam's defense isn't just limited to these systems. A sophisticated defense matrix, complete with radars, launchers, interceptors, and an ultra-modern command and control system, is to be stationed on the island. As per Vice Admiral John Hill, this protective net is specifically designed to ward off intricate missile threats that loom in the distance. The commitment of the Missile Defense Agency towards this mission is tangible, with a whopping budget request of more than $800 million in 2024 alone, the objective is crystal clear. Ensure Guam's safety against ballistic, cruise, and even the dreaded hypersonic missiles. And while half of this budget is earmarked for the design and evolution of this defensive architecture, another $38.5 million is being funneled to refine the command and control, battle management, and communications program, further fortifying Guam's shield. The collaboration doesn't end there. With the Army and Navy as allies, the defense of Guam is metamorphosing into an unyielding fortress. The Navy, with its Aegis weapon technology, is not only providing essential capability, but also exercising jurisdiction over the land that will cradle these defense assets. The Army's role is pivotal too, having been earmarked as the procurement spearhead. Their contribution? A staggering $638 million in equipment that includes a variety of missile launchers, defense systems, and the avant-garde Northrop Grumman-built Integrated Battle Command System. This system promises seamless coordination, connecting the perfect sensors with the perfect shooters in real-time combat scenarios. But adapting to Guam isn't without its challenges. The island's rugged terrains demand innovations. Hill mentioned earlier this year that the Aegis system set for Guam would be unlike any other, distinct from its counterparts on Aegis ships or the Aegis ashore sites in Romania and Poland. Couple this with the cutting-edge command suite being developed, which leverages the command control, battle management, and communication system technology. This suite, integrated with the integrated battle command system and Aegis command, stands as a sentinel, ever watchful for ballistic and hypersonic missile threats. Adding another layer to this defense matrix are the New Age Mobile ANTPY-6 radars. Harnessing technology from the long-range discrimination radar based in Alaska, these radars will serve as the vigilant eyes of Guam, scanning its surroundings for any potential threats. But before these become the reality of Guam's defense, they'll undergo the rigorous test of real-world scenarios. On August 16th, the long-range discrimination radar is scheduled to be put through its paces. The mission? To successfully launch an intercontinental ballistic missile target, testing the radar's prowess. Furthermore, December will also witness the ground-based mid-course defense system in action, showcasing a brand new interceptor capability. This two-stage selectable feature, as pointed out by Williams, will expand the interceptor's battle domain. And as the year unfolds, the skies will reverberate with more tests, from the SM-3 Block IIA to the Terminal High Altitude Area Defense System and the Patriots Missile Segment Enhancement Interceptors. Each will be scrutinized, ensuring they stand tall against the threats of tomorrow. In the backdrop of the Pacific's serenity, Guam is getting ready. Ready to defend, ready to protect, and ready to showcase the future of missile defense.